In this video, I'm going to show you an alternate method to using the Rocketbook app to get your homework turned in. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm inside the folder that I want my file to be in. So I'm going to grab new and I'm going to choose a Google Doc. and I'm going to go with a blank document. Then I'm going to title my document, whatever my assignment is. So my last name, Ballard Candy. Assignment number zero, 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 oh, so zero, 011, okay. Then I am going to grab my, I'm gonna insert and I'm gonna grab the screenshot that I've already done. I'm gonna upload that from my Google Drive. Hopefully it just pops up in my recent and make sure you're grabbing the correct screenshot. So there's the screenshot that I want. Sorry, this guy's in the way. All right, there's the screenshot that I want and I'm gonna click insert. So my screenshot with where my percentage of my homework and my name comes up. Then I'm going to go to insert and I need to take a picture image of my homework. So I'm gonna click camera and then I'm gonna allow it to use my camera, okay? And then I wanna make sure that it's held up and see this is why this one's trickier. I wanna make sure it's held up so that I can get all of my homework in there and it's clear and I can see it. So that's a little bit trickier to do than with your phone when it's able to sit on the table. And make sure that all, you can see all the problems in the shot, which I know I can't quite with mine. It was gonna have problems on the whole page. And then I'm gonna click insert. You don't need your little nose in the picture. Um, and then my homework goes in there. And then what you're gonna do is I want this file to be uploaded preferably as a PDF. So you're gonna go file, um, download and PDF. Hopefully, and see how it just came in down there. And then you're gonna take that file and upload it into Google Classroom. It might not be a bad idea to move it into your Google Drive for organization purposes.